Hey, it's me, Charlene. I'm doing a video response to Leslie and Char, me, uh, our 80s lounge channel. This is a response to it. It's about 80s products. Yes. Uh, I have to say, products back in the 80s are, were so much better than they are now. You would think they would be better now. But I think what's happened is they've caught on to trying to, I guess, make the environment better. So they take away from the, nat the ingredients that were there and they're going to more natural. And I think that's what's happening. And um, I mean, yeah, it's a good thing. But still, you know, back in the day, we had the best shampoo ever. Um, I remember, um, this was in the 90s, so, but they had an 80s, but I didn't work until the 90s, so I was in school, high school, and elementary in the 80s, but, um, in the 90s, I graduated in 91, but, um, this shampoo was in the 80s, though. I would wear, I would wash my hair every morning with Pantene. Do you remember the Pantene that was in like a small bottle and had like a silver or gold lid? It either was white with silver or gold, or it was pink, pink bottle with a silver lid, or it was purple with a silver lid or something. And the Pantene smelled so good. And your hair would smell like that all day long. I remember going to work. I'd wash my hair early in the morning. And I would smell my hair all throughout the day. And I would think, mmm, it smelled so good. It's kind of like, gee, your hair smells terrific. Yeah, that was another shampoo in the 80s. And there was, um, back in the 80s, a lot of us had perms. And I remember using um, perm so soft I think it was called perm so soft and it smelled so good and there was there was tame that was great a lot of the um, shampoos that Leslie was talking about I remember them and they were really good and yeah the Pantene today mm -mm. it doesn't smell good like it did and it, I don't even think it's as good as quality because years ago when we used Pantene, our hair was good. But now they're saying that the Pantene is very damaging to our hair. They say it's got glue in it, like glu glu gluten stuff in it. And so it's like we're putting glue in our hair. But um, we still use it. Um, but yeah, that... The shampoo and stuff back in the day, they were so much better than they are, to know, are now. And like washing powders. Um, in the eight, late 80s, 90s, whatever, um, we have always used, all my life, my family had used Tide, Gain, and Fab. And back in the day, gosh, they smelled so good. But now, since they've started making the scents different. You know, they've got all kinds of different scents out. Um, I still like the original. But, the original still does not smell like it once did. I mean, it smells good, but it doesn't smell like it once did. No, not at all. And, oh, and soap. Oh my gosh. I remember growing up, my mama used soap. It was, um, I think it was in a pink container, and it was called Kame. And oh, she smelled so good. She would wash in that. You could you could smell the smell all over the house. It just smelled so good. And I growed up using it too, and I loved it. And the only thing that I can come close to Kame, the one that she had used and that I'd used growing up, was is um, a new. I believe it's Dove. It's Dove, and it is a it's a pink bar, peach bar, pink peach bar. 
I believe it's called Dove. That's the only one I've come close to smelling like Camay. I loved Camay. Camay was wonderful. And it made your skin smell so good. It made it feel so good. And, oh, and I used, back in the 80s, I used VO5 hairspray. I used Rave hairspray, you know, to get that big hair, big hairdo. And, and just recently, I went and bought a, a can of Rave just to see, you know, use it occasionally. Uh, because I don't really use hairspray anymore, but I did back in, back in the 80s in high school. I sure did. And I sprayed it, and it was supposed to be scented. But it did not smell like it once did. Not at all, because it used to smell really good as well. Okay, I guess that's it. I guess I will get off here, and I will talk to you guys later. Um, adios, amigos. Um, catch you later, alligator. <laughs> Um, like, like for sure, like totally, like, you know, like for real. I'll be talking to you later. Peace out and take care. Bye for now. For sure.